What's up guys, today I'm happy to say that we are rooting the Verizon Galaxy Note 3. Thanks to the root by Design Gears, we are able to root without tripping any warranty flags and can easily revert back to stock just in case. So first, go to his XDA thread and download the required files. You can either use the torrent or use his mega download file. And then after you do that, install 7-zip and unzip it. I already have those here on my desktop right here. So what you need to do is first get your phone set up for rooting. Alright, so here's what you need to do to get your phone ready to root. First of all, you need to take out your SD card. You can leave your SIM in. So after you do that, let's go to the front, hold the volume down button, the home button, and hit the power button all at the same time. And then you will see this screen. Push volume up to continue. Alright, now we are ready to download. So, get your USB cable and plug it in. Now that your phone is ready, make sure you also install the most updated drivers for the device. You can find those on the second post of his thread. So, now we are ready to flash, so go to Odin. Make sure you select the tar file under AP. Alright, so now that it has checked, we can start the process. So just click start, and then everything should work out. Alright, so the device is now rebooted, but we still have one more really important step left. So, when you first get to the start menu, just click next, and wait for the menu to choose your media connection option. Alright, so right now connect as installer, change that to MTP, go to your computer, And make sure to copy the files included Alright, so go into your root directory of your phone. Copy in the root files. And then just reboot the device. Alright, the device has booted up again. And now, if you'll see, we have super user, but we still need to reboot the device one more time. So, go back to media device mode. And delete the root files.
and now restart your phone one more time. And now, as you can see, we can update the Super SU binary. And we should be good to go. So there you are, there's Root on the Galaxy Note 3 for Verizon.